there is a massive hidden factor in the evolution of humans over the past two million years. The course of human evolution in the last two million years sharply shaped by habitation shifts linked to astronomically driven climate changes, of course. The climate has to do with how people would have been able to survive. Scientists suggest in a new study using an unprecedented supercomputer simulation of Earth's climate as it transitioned through climactic shifts over the course of the Pleistocene epoch, research found that changes in variables such as rain, precipitation, and temperatures were linked with how a range of different hominin species, including Homo sapiens, settled or wandered over eons of human prehistory. Even though different groups of archaic humans preferred different climactic environments, their habitats all responded to climate shifts caused by astronomical changes in Earth's axis wobble, Earth's tilt, and Earth's orbital eccentricity, says climate physicist Axel Timmerman from Pusan National University in South Korea. The results add a significant weight behind the argument that prehistoric episodes of climate change helped to spur evolutionary developments in the Homo genus, a long suspected but nonetheless difficult to prove hypothesis due to lack of hard climactic data overlapping contemporaneously with discoveries of archaic humans in the fossil record. He said, one of the most notable problems is that terrestrial records of habitat information, such as that obtained from sedimentary outcrops and paleo lake drill cores, are often limited in terms of time frames of data available, he said, explains archaeologist also Michael Petraglia from Max Planck Institute for the Science of Human History in Germany. He was not involved with the study, but is the author of a commentary on these findings. To sidestep, Timmerman and his team modeled changes in environmental conditions across the Earth over a period of two million years, incorporating astronomically triggered climate shifts due to Earth's movement. It's known as the Milankovitch cycles. The simulation running on South Korean supercomputer called Aleph took over six months to crunch the numbers, producing what the team says is the longest running comprehensive climate model simulation to date. The researchers then compared the data to the documented presence of several hominin species in the fossil record, including Homo erectus, Homo heidelbergensis, and Homo neanderthalensis, among others, and encompassing over 3,000 geochronologically constrained hominin fossils and associated materials. The results tell a complex story of how different hominin groups variously dispersed across Earth over time, but they also suggest that the dispersals and contrasting periods of habitation in the same spot were tied to, of course, climactic patterns affecting factors such as temperature suitability and food availability. Timmerman says, our study documents that climate played a fundamental role in the evolution of our genus Homo. We are who we are because we have managed to adapt over millennia to slow shifts in the past climate. As one example, the researchers suggest that climate stress in southern Africa could have been what led to the rise of Homo sapiens and Homo heidelbergensis went extinct, beyond uh, suggesting that the climate data played a role in human evolution the study goes further, even further, arguing that shifts in human adaption cannot be fully explained without recourse to a broader understanding of climate, uh, climate, climactic factors and affecting ecosystems. And they said, to understand hominin evolution during the Pleistocene, the full spatial and temporal complexity of the climate signal and the corresponding habitat suitability must be co uh, considered. According to Petraglia, it will fall to new fieldwork investigations to experimentally verify such ideas, carefully scrutinizing fossil records to discover traces of paleo environmental information we have not yet uncovered. He says, there is still much to learn about evolutionary implications of climactic variability over the past two million years. This study provides a starting point for testing a range of theories about how climactic and habitat shifts shape, shape the distribution diversification, and dispersal of hominin species. The findings were reported in the journal Nature magazine. This is by Peter Doctoral Science Alert. Please leave your comments and thank you for your support.
kindly support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.